Hi everyone, this one is going to show you how to use the GoTo tool, uh, not just to navigate to a specific cell, but give you an idea about the GoTo tool in Excel. And if you've watched the previous video, then you could possibly skip through this one because it's going to overlap with that one. Um, except I did bother to look up where to find the GoTo tool because one of the things I was saying in the previous one is that I prefer keyboard shortcuts because they save a lot of time and you're watching this to save yourself a lot of time. So, um, officially, the GoTo tool, well, what it is, the GoTo tool lets you go to a specific cell or a named range or a named anything query <coughs> to, to navigate there quicker than having to use your keyboard to, you know, scroll down and do all that stuff. This is tedious, it takes a long time and you don't want to do it. Now, uh, it's not really part of the GoTo tool, but the most um, on hand thing you have is the name box. It works much like the GoTo tool. If you type in A100, it will get you to cell A100. It also shows you where you are at any given moment. So as I move it out here, see how the name box changes. And if I now say B20, it will go up to B20. So that's what I use. Now for keyboard shortcuts, the official GoTo tool is accessed by pressing Ctrl and G. Control G and you'll see it remembers anything I picked in the name box beforehand and you can click on any of these things and you can also just type in things and so if I want to select query one which is this big table here um, I just do query one and OK uh, alternatively I'll just go back into Control G I can do you know uh, let's do B20 again because see we've moved up so let's do B20 it then goes to B20 um, going back again Control G you have your special ones and you can select a whole bunch of things now admittedly I think if you if you quite well know what the current array is or a precedent or a dependent then you probably don't really need to be around here but it's quite useful so if you want to select anything differences um, the last cell is kind of useful actually or the visible cells only um, we'll talk about later what a visible cell is or what a, a hidden cell is um, data validation is quite good and this is where you select your special things and last but not least the official way to access uh, the non-keyboard shortcut version of um, the GoTo tool is that in Home you go into Find and Select and it's going to be GoTo and GoTo Special and notice how if I mouse over GoTo it just says Ctrl G uh, and yeah what's faster than scrolling? Jumping and what's faster than jumping? Well jumping with your keyboard um, and then go to special doesn't have a keyboard shortcut so if you want to access that one you have to get into go to which is Ctrl G and then just click special or alt s and that's how you do the go to tool now the next one is going to be working with cells and doing inserts and select so it's a uh, new and exciting video coming up and make sure you watch and any queries you may have use youtube to drop me a comment thank you